second and final day of the Frontier Conference Track and Field Championships as competitors have one last try to get first place, PR, or reach national qualifying marks. We'll head straight into some of the field events as we go to the men's shot put with Carroll's Garrett Kokab, already a Class B qualifier at Nationals. He puts up a throw of 15.72, good enough for a PR and first place. In women's shot put, Carroll kept the ball rolling as Nikki Kruger, third in the country, she throws a 13.52 to also take first. The University of Providence women would make their mark in the throwing category as Mackenzie Clark won javelin, Jillian Sanchez hammer throw, and then second or third place finishes in shot put and discus. Over to the track as we start the 1500 meter race with 7th nationally ranked Rocky Mountain Sydney Little Light on an absolute tear. She wins with a time of 4 minutes and 42.16 seconds. On the men's side, same race. It's also Rocky Mountain College with the win as 9th ranked Jackson Wilson posts a winning mark of 4 minutes and 8.66 seconds. In the men's 400 meter hurdles, B qualifier Chad Hemsley gets it done for Carroll, finishing up with a time of 56.44 seconds. To round it out, Montana Tech's prize distance runner proved her number one status in the 5,000 meter, finishing with a 17 minute and 26.67 second time after qualifying for her third event yesterday in the 10,000 meter. She wins handedly to wrap up an excellent day at the Frontier Conference Championships. As always, full results can be found on MontanaSports.com. In Great Falls, I'm Dylan Foreman, MTN Sports.